Are you ready to work your abs? I'm Samantha Clayton, fitness expert and former competitive sprinter, and working with Herbalife to help you achieve a healthy, active life. Today, we're gonna to focus on engaging your core and work on getting that perfect flat tummy or serious six pack. In just five minutes, I expect you to feel a burn and realize that lack of time is not a good enough excuse for not working out your midsection. Remember, some exercises are not right for everyone. So please listen to your body and if an exercise doesn't feel right, then opt for a modified version or stick with an exercise that feels good and fits in with your current fitness level. Let's begin by warming up our core with a few of my favorite standing moves and then we'll take it to the floor for the remainder of the workout. Start out with hip circles. Stand with your feet shoulder width apart, place your hands on your hips and rotate your hips in small circles. Gradually increase your movements. And now let's switch direction. Our next move we're going on to is called side bends. So I just want you to stand up tall, place your hands on the outside of your thighs and just slowly bend sideways. Slide your hands down towards your knee. Remember to breathe. Our next move we're going on to is high knee ab crunch. So place your hands up overhead, make a fist, and as you lower your elbows down, lift your knees up to meet your elbows and crunch your torso. Just keep switching legs and repeat. Inhale on the way up and exhale as they come down. Let's take it to a standing ab twist next. Place your hands behind your head and lift one knee up as you twist and touch your opposite elbow to opposite knee like so. Don't push your head forward and make sure you do this movement in a controlled manner, focusing on your balance. Now let's lie down on the floor for some crunches. Lie down on the floor and do a pelvic tilt to ensure that you're in the correct position. Place your hands behind your head, contract your core and just lift your shoulders up off the floor and lower back down. Now stay on the floor with your back on the, on the mat, hands behind the head, and the feet are extended in front of you, one leg off the ground. And we're just gonna do a continuous motion. And then bring your right elbow to your left knee, and your left elbow to right knee. And if you need to modify this move, you can just go back to doing the leg action with your arms and head on the floor. Modified version. It's time to flip over onto your tummy and get into a push-up position. But instead of being on your hands, rest your forearms on the floor. Now tighten your core and your glutes 
and keep as straight as you can. Remember to breathe as we hold for 30 seconds. Remember to breathe. Our next move is reverse crunches. You want to sit up with your knees bent. Cross your arms over your chest and then slowly lean down by engaging your abs. Lower just a few inches and sit back up. You can do this move holding your thighs if you need the support. Okay, we've been through one time. You know the moves, so let's focus on working hard for two full minutes. Are you with me? Let's go with our crunches. Just 30 seconds. Now let's go straight into that bicycle move. Legs are up. Few more. Now flip over into plank position and hold a strong core. Hold nice and controlled. Okay, here we go, last 30 seconds. Controlled reverse sit-ups. I hope you enjoyed my five minute abdominal burn workout and can find ways to add some or all of these exercises to your current routine.